Hey, uh, it's your boy, and uh, today, conquer. Why? I don't know. Wow, you can't you can't actually skip this intro movie. That's really fucking weird. So strange. The cock and plucker, which I assume is some British way of saying balls and ass or, or something. I don't know for sure. Oh wow, this is the weird way. This this is the main menu. It is so strange. Oh, that guy from uh, uh, Bill and Mandy. That's neat. I keep looking at that chick in the back. Alright, I gotta stop looking. Exp options. Damn, that's not a lot. Anyway, we want to do the single player because Xbox Live isn't a thing anymore. I mean, on for this game. Hey, so I'm gonna be real with y'all. I've never played this. Now, I mean to say I've never played a live and reloaded or uncut and uncircumcised, whatever this version of the game is called. I've played Conquer 1 a hell of a lot. I think I beat the N64 original. And I've owned this version of the game for like five years or more. I picked it up at a con, I think. Microsoft presents, oh, I bet they do, man. You really think about it, it's like Rare and the Xbox was like the biggest waste in the world. Like they released what, this? And Grabbed by the Ghoulies? And I think that's it? Like, it's so sad. Was there something else that I'm misremembering oh man oh shit that's su still super scary the way he looks in fact we're gonna talk a, a, a bit about the way this game looks because I'm personally not a fan I mean we'll, we'll, we'll get to it when we can get to it and I always kind of I'm pretty sure this is supposed to be a Conan reference like the movie how it, it, it starts in really tight on Conan and then pulls out like this, and he's basically won. And then he regales us with the story of how he got here. And all of his googly-eyed rare creations just well, hanging out. So yeah, what some of the things I know about this game is that this is more censored than the N64 version. I think all the swears are gone. Like every swear, even like stuff like damn and hell maybe? I'm not sure about that particular of it, but it's still weird. So many people, if they've never seen this game before, are drawing furiously now. Hi, you've reached, like, Barry's place? I'm so we can't have Candy so Kong anymore, <laughs> so Barry! Like, I like Conker's no, outfit, guys, cute little tomorrow, shorts, some, little little hoodie know, there, I like it. His Akajo Windbreaker! Well, don't give him a tenor or Virgil will take uh, it. I don't feel so good now. <laughs> Whoa, watch it. Oh, no! God, that gives me flashbacks of a lot of moves in Bo Rai Cho's moveset. Sorry about that old chap. Go. Yeah, if you didn't want, like, uh, throw up to be splatterized all over you, don't be standing around outside the cock and plucker, I guess. Looks like he's crying. It's like all, <laughs> all these tears. It's just the rain, but it's like all these tears sh shooting out of Conker's, like, chest and eye area. Alright, like, the bad guy of Conker is like a King Panther man. He's like this really sexy, sexy panther dude. I think he's a panther. Some type of jungle cat. And so many rare Nintendo villains are just angry animal with a, uh, <laughs> crown on it. This guy, King K. Rule, Bowser, Wart. I don't know who the villain is, what a lot of other rare games are. Oh, General Scales is pretty much just General Scales! It's pretty much the same thing. Man, they sure went nuts with fur shading after Star Fox. Like, fur shade everything! I don't care if it's got fur on it, fur shade it! 
It's take one of those like morning after pills. I mean, not not the regular type for other stuff. I mean, the, the stuff to stop hangovers, man. I've never used those effectively. I don't even know if they work. But uh, yeah, I'm Conquer. So this looks quite nice. I was going to say about the visuals, I kind of find the more crude looking N64 version to kind of play into this game a bit more. Like because that looks so crude, it, it, it kind of uh, fits in a bit better with the crudeness of, of the subject material. But I guess since this is running on my 3.6, it just looks nicer than, than it would usually. Azua. I think all of the voice actors are um, rare employees. Like Conquer is Chris Sevor, I think. Oh, I'll step over here. Right here. You see those buttons? Buttons. Yeah. Okay. I kind of forgot that Conquer is more all about context sensitivity and not so much platforming. There's this is platforming for sure. The light comes on, and it makes this noise, ding, right? That ding noise. You guys, ding. There you go, the ting, the ting. That's it. Yeah. Okay, I'll press B. Which I guess you would have to record. I mean, no, I guess you wouldn't really have to record B because there was a B button on the N64, but. Context sensitivity. I don't know if I do. Oh, it's just going through his polygons. So, what does that mean? It means context sensitive. It's sensitive to <laughs> context. Try <laughs> right over there. All right, all right, we'll, okay. we'll do it. Okay, I am so hung over. No, I'll do it over there. So every button that you press just does a weird hiccup thing, or like Conquer is very uncoordinated right now. The the sort of hangover and this music must have been what a lot of rare employees felt like when they found out that Microsoft had just bought the company. <laughs> what are you pulling out of there, little Conky? Alka Seltzer. Oh, just what I needed. In I fact, wish it worked that good. It seemed to me that these give me just what I need at that moment in time. Oh, I see what he means. Context sensitive. All right, now we're in the game. Now we can jump. Now we're playing Super Lucky's Tale, the original version. Oh, I can't seem to get any further. Jeez, look at all that dripping something. coming from his mouth. Uh, that looks yeah. gross. Now I remember. Uh, then, right. now then I'll hold R to crouch. And then I'll do a, a super fun cool jump. Okay, cool. Oh, that kind of worked. Don't I have like a little spin? Yeah. If you're a fuzzy land creature and you're in a rare game, you do a spin. If you have a big ponytail or a bushy eyebrows, pubic hair, tails, whatever you got. Oh shit, the real Dark Souls starts now. He's just gonna burninate everything in front of me. Ah, who's this guy? If you think you're coming this way, you can think again. This sounds like the voice of the scarecrow. I just wanna get past, please. No, I don't think so. I've only just got comfy. It was an age on a piece of, of gargoyles for 200 years. Gets right up your ass, you know. Thought it was about time. So he said ass, and it said arse. I'm, I'm a big now. fan of arse. But yeah, no, I did hear how this game is more censored in the swears. Let me know well, if I'm wrong about if you that. To come a bit closer, we can discuss things of another nature. Oh! I was so scared, but I did it anyway. Am I dead? No, okay, good. So I need to fucking kill this guy's ass. Oh, key. I need that guy. Huh? 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 Son of a bitch! Goddamn fucker! Hang on a second. This is 
really no good at all. Hmm. I need a weapon. Yeah. Ah. Let's you do it. Any, any, any of those but the frying pan. Mm. Mo. The frying oh. Pan. I mean, I guess it's a cartoon game. Equipped. And now everyone's super scared. <gasps> That's my key. Yes, great. I thought the designer said this was just a straight port. What a hack. Now, which one was it? Oh, okay, some some rare humor there. Ugh. Don't like these enemies. They're quite like horrific. Whoa, that's violent. I guess I'll go back to the way I came. All right, well, I have a weapon. I'm not sure if that's enough to take care of the gargoyle. Maybe it is. We'll try it. This is a bad idea. A frying pan. Yeah. <laughs> stupid little. There you go. I think that's what I was thinking of. Wasn't he meant to fall off here? Hey. Weren't you meant to fall off? This here? is the part where you fall down. Yes. But the designer thought it wise to change the training level a bit. To fool the audience into thinking that the rest of the game would also be different. I'm afraid Oh you shit, have really? To try okay. Something else. Lucky I brought this as well in. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, 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 why? You missed the designer. No more surprises, please. Man, this game is still pretty charming. I mean, especially with the updated dialogue and stuff. Go, 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 go. Yeah, context sensitivity. It's going to take over the game yeah, industry, you'll see. Um, I think I know what's going to happen now. <laughs> yep. Fantastic. Superb. Great. Let's Amazing. Let's go and get some shut-eye. Finally. I mean, to be you were sleeping this, this entire time, but I guess it, you need, like, hangover oh. sleep. Wow. <sighs> That was not a large distance. All right, let's see what King Panthro. Yeah, this guy does a lot of it too. And then there's Tedsies and shit. Is that just like a Cadbury chocolate? That's will do. That's will do. When I say Cadbury chocolate, I mean like caramel. It looks like chocolate. It really does. Eat it! Eat it, you fucker! That's nice, that's nice, I like that. Oh, look how nice and colorful this area is. What? So forgive me, it has been a long time since I played Conquer. I mean, I played with Liam like a long time ago and I barely remember it. I don't even think we got this far. I'm just gonna be ready. I gotta be ready to hit. Ooh, not quite Devil May Cry, but it's close. So I remember the big deal about Conquer is that when it was first revealed in like a Nintendo Power, I think me and along with probably a lot of fans on the N64 were kind of getting tired of just rare platformers all being kind of all cutesy wootsy and all, you know, very colorful and very the same. So when Conquer was first shown, I'm sure m many people know this, but just in case uh, they showed it and then it just kind of went dark for a long time. And I, I think Rare kind of said, like, yeah, we kind of realized maybe we should have been doing something a bit more interesting. And then they just retooled everything to be this more foul mouth, uh, again, context sensitivity thing. It doesn't really work like collectathons like Banjo Kazooie and whatnot. And it's probably a good thing that they did that. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, this is a bad thing that I've done. Guys, trying to steal our nice new high. What? But how can you That's even so fit in it? Yeah, let's get him. This is a bad thing that has happened to Matthew Conker. In the water. Oh. Oh, he jumped it. That's kind of funny. I was trying to dive into the water because that's what you do. 
Matt's being stung by dozens of bees and everyone's laughing at him. That's what he has to do. I don't want to talk about it. All right, this big bee bit my bottom. My bottom is not quite big yet, but... That's horrible. You look horrible. Everyone needs to stop crying in this. All right, the, of all the areas I want sting, my butt is, it's not the lowest, but it's not the highest in the list of things I want stung. I think it'll work, I think it'll work. These are very slow flying bees, I mean wasps. Yeah. I don't get how this hive works. Oh, shit. Turns into full gore. Please explode in a horrific display. There you go. What do I get? Somebody call for me. Yeah. Oh, I some of the dope. You're mine. A lot, a lot of you splatterized all over. Cash prizes. All right, who's this? Looks like uh, one of them skills. Look, we should get down there, kick the shit out of him. Nah, wait till he comes up here, eh? alright. Okay, then, yeah. Oh, what accent is that? Please let me know in the comments what that's yeah. trying to go for. Oh. Alright, I can torture everything in the world with this. Oh god, this guy's gonna get it. Oh, Fuck you. Oh shit. Ew! Ten minutes! But I want it now! Whatever it is. Ten o'clock. Time it now. Oh, that's a baller oh. watch. Well, I suppose I'll come back later then. Yeah, this is good, some good ass music, man. This is that fire. Mm. Okay, they don't think they want me here. Somebody doesn't want me to be here. Yeah. They certainly don't want me to go that way. Um, think I'll go that way. He's a mischievous squirrel. Well, is it safe? I wonder. Mm hmm. <laughs> I do not feel good about this. Wait, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> oh. Uh oh. Oh God, no. <laughs> I think it's about to. Oh Lord. No, he's dead. Well, I hope you guys enjoy. Oh, he's not dead. Ah, heck. Okay, so that was death. Um, I, I kind of forget what happens with death and conquer. Now, let's see. Ah, oh, yes. Conquer. Surname? The Squirrel. You're one of these special cases. Oh, Ooh, really? I'm special. Yes. Apparently, according to the powers that be distributed around your little world, are these tail things. Squirrel's tails. If you can get them, I'll give you an extra chance. Understand? Those are the um, rules that the well, cosmic order ordained. Okay. Alright, so there's one right there. It's very <laughs> dangerous, but I'll try to get it. Alright, it's not that dangerous, actually. Hello, do you know where the one with the big titties is? Hello? Where's the plant with the tits? No? It's not happening? God, everything is just a rare creature. It's just googly eyes on everything. They were so right. I see you, I see you, little fella. You better get this fat ass bitch <laughs> off from my back pronto. Gee, so many people around here want me to solve their problems. What do you say? Like it's a video you? game. I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I say I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. You get rid of that freaking mouse cur, uh, and maybe I'll help you out. That mouse is cute, I wanna maybe. get rid of him. Oh, just one more thing to say. Just one Man, more weren't these thing. exact boxes right, in, in like a uh, uh, ukulele in the impossible lair? Jack, and everything will be just dandy. Alright, so we just sent for him. I'm sorry, rat. Oh wait, maybe I need cheese for the rat. This is how this game works. It's like a bartering system. Hi, you must be Bert. I'm Bert. Jack sent me. 
I'm opening it for you here, and you can get on with whatever that you're trying to do. What are they going for with that guy? Okay. Cheese. Cheese, cheese, cheese. Rat, rat. Are you happy? Oh, you stinky cheese rat. Here, devour this living creature. All right, here comes the final cheese. Yes. Oh, no. He said one more will do it, so this is what he wanted. No, it's horrible. Ew. Rare. It seems okay. Aw, oh, come on. How very dead alive of you. She's like, yes. Now it's no longer gross. Last than a moment longer there. Thank you very much, Mr. Squirrel. Okay, I guess I need money. But look, you can see the Tatas hanging out. This has to happen. Okay, so the person that's been yelling hey over here has been uh, shut up. It's money! Does it every time. You want some great stuff. But it, would a British squirrel really like an American yeah, dollar? I think around on me. I'm gonna get tanked tonight. Dude, you gotta pace yourself. Hello, cool. well, I have money now. Still nothing. No. But now it's 10 o'clock, so it's time to go back to poo zone. And the poo, the poo cabin will tell me what to do. Where does fur shading go? Oh wait, there it is. It's popping in. He really wants his table fixed. Just do go to IKEA. We have here, if you look, the table. If you analyze the table closely, as I have yeah, done, his like we can fix the table by putting conquer as a table leg. And we're not like sometimes you can be so about. silly that it's silly, it's and sometimes it's just about. silly. And he's like all into it. He's like, yeah, I know that's, you know, science, man. All right, so what's so neat in this poo-poo cabin? So this is where we are in life, everyone. You're watching me play this and I'm playing this. So here we go. Yeah. That bull. Ah, right. I remember this bull. Hey, uh, excuse me. Hello. Yeah, you. Uh, <clears throat> He looks very friendly. Friendly type. Conquer's playing Killer Instinct. And he's just spamming fireballs as Jago. It's a lot of farting noises. <laughs> I have to turn on this valve, I think. That's my recollection of it. There you go. Counterclockwise is the only true way. All right, prune juice, cause poo. Now, and logic would denote that something that drinks that. It's gonna get the screaming squit. That's good enough. Oh god. Ah, a cow. Now that could be useful. Wait, Stop what? Nonsense, young man. Goodness me. I've quite lost my appetite now. I'm gonna go I'm gonna go for a little meander over here. Hmm. Actually, I feel a bit thirsty. A nice little beverage should wash this tasty grass down lovely like. That's not what how that works, but okay. Oh my god, I'm sorry everybody. Oh Mavis and Olive are probably watching this being live streamed. What's with that? Why is Rare so obsessed with that shit? It's fucking weird. This is, I'm killing a lot of animals in this. Oh. Mm, yes. Much better. I won't be spilling my milk anymore. Really? This is how it's gonna end? I couldn't beat the bull boss and then... Oh, that's horrible! That's a really bad fur day! 
So, hey, Conquer's Bad Fur Day is still really charming. Uh, you can't play the Xbox Live version, obviously, but the uh, N64 version is still on Rare Replay on the Xbox One, so there's that. But um, it plays a little not very precise in its platforming, I kind of feel. Everything feels a little bit more slippery, like, you know, it, it's a bit rougher than, say, Banjo-Kazooie. I know this game is not doing the exact same thing Banjo was doing, but... I, I, I don't know. It's, I mean, maybe it's just this remake and the N64 version is a bit more precise in its controls and felt a bit better to play. That's just me. I'm just saying. Let me know in the comments below how wrong I am. And then, oh my god, I just realized it's Banjo's head above the fireplace. <laughs>